How's it going, guys? Alright, today I'm going to be reviewing a movie that came out not too long ago. You know, it's just sort of... Um, when did this come out? I believe it came out 2008. Yes, this movie was released in 2008, and this movie is called The Unborn. Um, who does the star? Some hot chick. Who is she? I forget her name. I don't know. It's... I don't know. I. But she's hot in here. Anyways, um, apparently it's... Uh, in association with Michael Bay. At least that's what it says, which is kind of weird. Oh, wait, yeah, okay, you know what? I do remember Michael Bay was involved with this movie, which explains a lot. Alright, again, it's been a while since I've seen this movie, so please forgive me if I get the facts wrong. Um, but from what I remember, The Unborn is a film, again, about this chick. She's hot, and um, basically what happens is she... Um, she I, what happened... She had a baby, I think. She had a baby and it died. That's what I want to say. I think she had a baby and then it passed away or something like that. And she's all upset about it, but she's, you know, she's living on with her life. She's just, you know, whatever. She's going to make another one, hopefully. And uh, But it turns out that this unborn baby um, haunts her, I, I'm assuming. I don't think it's the unborn baby that haunts her. I think that just, like, kind of just haunts her memory a little bit. But what, what really haunts her is, like, a, she keeps seeing, seeing these spirits, you know, she, these ghosts. And she's trying to figure out why she keeps searing the, seeing, searing, seeing this um, paranormal, supernatural spirits. And, uh, you know, they're just kind of haunting her, like, demons and stuff. And, uh, let's see, who who's the exorcist in here? Gary Oldman plays the exorcist, and, uh... The last half hour of this film is very, very, very scary. Not, no, I take that back. It's not scary, but it's actually pretty damn cool. Um, you know, the movie's pretty, it, there's a lot of jump scares, like jump at you kind of stuff, but it's not really anything too scary. Like, there are some pretty frightening and scary imagery, but nothing to really, like, give you nightmares or anything like that, but, um, yeah. From what I remember, this movie was okay. Like, it wasn't very well made. The acting was kind of blah, and, you know, it just, it wasn't very, it was good. Like, it's your average teen, not slasher, supernatural film, average teen supernatural horror film. But, you know, it's nothing too special. You don't really need to, if you haven't seen this movie, you can live without it. No big deal, and you're not going to die. But um, it is a pretty cool watch, you know, for a rainy day, I guess. Pretty cool popcorn flick if you want to get scared. This is actually a lot um, scarier than most movies that come out, in my opinion. But um, I really liked The Unborn. I know a lot of people didn't like it. It did get a mix to negative reviews, but I, I really enjoyed it. Overall, I'd probably give The Unborn 3.5 out of 5 stars. I was about to give it 4 there, but I decided to give it 3.5 because it's just, it's, it's just too high. But um, 3.5 for me, very scary. Or... What's another word for scary? I don't want to say scary. I want to say frightening. It has a lot of jump scares. That's all I'm going to say. But definitely check this one out if you haven't. It's a pretty cool film. So, yeah. There you go. Alright, guys. Please leave a comment down below on what movie I should review next. And I will see you guys later.